Good morning and welcome to the GHS Reporter. Today is Tuesday, November 29th and I'm Derek Griffin. The suspect in the mass shooting deaths of 10 African American customers at a Buffalo grocery store earlier this year pleaded guilty to numerous hate crimes and murder charges. According to CBS, these charges will ensure that he will spend the rest of his life in prison. The suspect pleaded guilty to 10 counts of first degree murder, 10 counts of second degree murder, and 3 counts of attempted murder as hate crimes. He will be sentenced for all of his crimes on February 15, 2023. Every year, the Melody Center at Albany Med welcomes hundreds of children through their doors. One five-year-old, Sunny, who has leukemia from Page Elementary School, had a wish of collecting art supplies and craft supplies this holiday season to give back to the organizations that helped her, have helped her so much through her cancer journey. Unfortunately, recently, Sunny is back in the hospital, but through a joint effort between different schools in different school districts amongst different grade levels, we are hoping to make Sunny's wish still come true. North Stars will be collecting donations of any new coloring books, crayons, watercolors, markers, or any other craft or art supplies in the donation bins outside of rooms 43 and 103. Thanks. Happy Holidays. The United States plays Iran in a win or go home match today at 2. The top two teams in Group B move on and the United States currently sits third. Both of their matches so far have been draws. The U.S. is favored to win today's match and if they do so, they will move on to the round of 16. That's all for the GHS Reporter today. Remember to find today's announcements on Twitter at GHS Announcement. I'm Derek Griffin. Today is an A-Day. Have a good day.